his music is saying F you to the audience but in a really beautiful way it's like F you i love you now let me play you some beautiful music you know so there's this feeling like um they're gonna do whatever they want and, and assert their own will and not worry about how it's being understood or whatever yet the wonderful thing about that is that it speaks to people Yo, what's up guys? Um, so we did get the wheels done and I will show you guys in a bit. But what me and Johnny are gonna do right now is we're gonna do eyelids on the EG's headlights. So what I'm doing is just using Plasti Dip and so far I just kinda shaped it how I want it, just leaving this part. And I'm gonna be using Plasti Dip and I'll show you guys how to do that right now. So let me go grab the Plasti Dip. So there goes the first coat. And then let me grab the other one. Okay, and then the other one. So that's the first coat. We are going to let it sit for a while. And then I will be right back. Yo, I did put on two more coats. I didn't get that on camera. Because I'm currently editing a vlog. But you can tell it is pretty dark. So I'm going to hit it with one more coat. So let's go real quick. that dry and then we're gonna start taking all of that off so let's wait <sighs> what Johnny's doing right now is she's cutting it because some of the plastic tip is gonna be on the paint or yeah the plastic tip is gonna be on the tape so Johnny right now is cutting it and I will show you guys how it looks after and yo there you guys go here let me get a light for y'all there y'all go um, I could go more down, but I think I'm just going to leave it like that. I think they do look good. And time to go put them back on the car. So let's go do that real quick. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another vlog. Um, so I'm going to show you guys how to do a canard um, videos before. I didn't really guys show you guys how. So I'm going to show you guys how in this video. Um, the reason why I'm doing another canard because I had some shitty things happen to me the past week. Um, so... What's today? Today's Saturday. Um, Friday morning. I was getting ready for work, you know. I grabbed my keys. And I'm about to go warm up my car. And my fucking car is not there. And so, yeah. Uh, my car got jacked. They took two wheels. The rear wheels, I don't know. Um, they took my Nardi wheel. But it was my dumbass fault because I left it in there, so... And they fucked up. Let's see what they fuck up. Um, so they fucked up. They fucked up my hatch. I can no longer put in the key to to pop the hatch anymore. Um, oh yeah, they took my radio too. So that's fucking awesome. And yeah. So it's just a bunch of shady ass people on the rail. And I kind of know... I kind of have an idea who I might think it is, but I, you know, I don't want to throw any names, you know, and assume. So I'm gonna wait till I have evidence, and then yeah. But so the reason why I'm doing another canard is because they ripped off one side. I don't know why you guys should have just ripped off both of them. And if you're watching this, fuck you. But that's not gonna stop us. We're gonna come back stronger than ever. So I'm gonna be doing another canard. Um, I will show you guys how to do it right now. And I did get the, all the wheels replaced, by the way. I got those replaced, and then I got I got a new stereo. Not new, but a newer one for the car. And, yeah, so let me show you guys how to do a canard real quick. I need to get all my stuff laid out. So, let's go. This is what you will be needing, guys. So, I got um, a cutter. I got this professional plastic cutter shit. I'm going to be using this, I'm going to be using that, and then you're going to need a sharpie, get a sharpie, and then also you will be needing 
This is what I use. Um, acrylic, just acrylic sheet. It doesn't matter. I just got a small one because I'm not doing big ones. And so let me show you guys how to do it real quick. And yeah, so guys, the first thing you guys are gonna wanna do is if you have one pre, I have one already cut out. So what I did before was use a piece of cardboard and kind of shape the one that I wanted. So we're gonna go and mark this real quick. Hell uh, yeah. So that's gonna be the mark out. So what you guys are gonna do next is just basically cut it. That's all you gotta do next. And again, I bought a plastic thing, a plastic cutter supposedly. But I also used a saw too, but if you use a hand saw, be really careful because this shit can crack while you're cutting it. So this is gonna be my first time using this. So hopefully it goes good. Boom, there you guys go. Um, so I cut it out. Um, I leave the plastic on there just in case. I think personally it helps out when cutting. So now it's time to, I'm going to start to mount it. Um, actually what I'm going to do first is grab some sanding paper and kind of sand it down to have the edges more sharper. Like this one's not that sharp, this corner. So let's do that real quick. And then what you guys want to do is mark where you guys want to screw it at. So I already measured it on the bumper. And yeah, so... That's what you guys want to do. So right now, me and Johnny are going to use a self-tapping screw to do it. So let's get this holes, holes drilled real quick, and then i show you, show you guys what to do next. So let's do this. And then, boom, you guys make your guys' holes, as you can see. So what you guys are going to want to do now, um, you're going to want to need some L brackets and some little screws and nuts and shit so i got some little ones that i'm going to be using with a little nut and i'm just going to i already drilled the hole so i'm just going to hand screw this in so let me put these in and i'll show you guys how it's going to look boom there you guys go they are in and then what i'm going to do now is i'm going to spray them you can spray them whatever color you want but i'm going to go with black i'm going to go with the original black normal shit and you can either use Plasti Dip or you can do regular paint. Um, my other one is regular paint, so you guys can do that. But it's really up to you. You could do whatever color because it is clear, so it really doesn't matter. So let's get this painted real quick and then let's throw it on the car. Yo, and this is how it looks when it's all painted. I really like actually the... I use Plasti Dip actually. Um, I actually really like this a lot more than the ones I currently had. So I'm going to go mount them on. That's all you do is put it through the L bracket and put it on. That's about it. So I'm going to go put them back on and I'll show you guys how it looks right after. Screwed it in and everything and that's how it looks. I really like this one because it's hugging more to the bumper than the other one did. So that's how you guys do a canard guys. It's not that hard like at all. Um, I think I spent a total of $10. So not bad at all. Yo, yo, what is up, guys? I just got off of work. Um, this is April 2nd. But I did have a package coming. Uh, it's for the EG. So, let's open this bitch up. Yo, my fucking window visors came in. Ayy. Guys, it is on. Um, we're going to let it dry. We're going to put some towels over it because it is raining. And I was really impatient because I really wanted to get them on. But I will show you guys how it looks all around when it stops raining. So see you guys in a bit. Oh, by the way, shout out to our new sponsor. Um, I'll show I'll show you guys his decal. We we got the Dirty Crew sticker now. But here's a little walk around with the windows visors on. And a so we went with one of my homeboys. I love his fucking work, and plus he's local, and I get him a lot faster than what I was getting him with Sticker Boost. So, if you guys want fucking sick ass stickers, hit him up. I will put his link down below. So, hit him up if you're in Utah, or even if not, he'll ship them to you. Hit him, hit him. 
way up, but here's the rest of the walk around. Hey, that shit looks sick as fuck, though, cuz. Hey. <laughs> but, hell yeah. Yeet, yeet. So, um, right now, me and Gianni, we are going to the store because tomorrow is my baby mama's birthday. And I am taking her to the Lakers game. So, we are going to go get her flowers right now. So, I'll see you guys at Harmon's. up guys um so that's going to be the end of today's vlog i hope you guys enjoyed and i hope that was helpful if you ever want to do canards um for your car so that's just one method that's just one way i did it i just thought of it and yeah so i'm gonna end today right now and oh and also update so we are not going to be representing sticker boost anymore um they're a great company Honestly, they really, they really are. And they are also local. They're more in Lehigh. But I just felt like, me and Johnny felt like, we have a good guy that we go to, a good homie. And his name is Adam. So shout out to Adam. And we're going to be representing his brand for all of those vinyls. Plus, I've been going to him for much longer since I've been even, like, even known about Sticker Boost. So, again, shout out Sticker Boost. Y'all dope. If you guys need any other custom-made stuff, go hit them up. But if you're in Utah, hit up Adam. His decals are awesome. They are great quality shit. No lie. If you see me at meet, check him out. Quality, nice. He, does a, he has a whole lot of stuff you can do. Just hit him up and he'll give you a good-ass price. But... I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure to like and subscribe for future content. And we will be having some more do-it-yourself kind of videos coming soon. And we also will be kicking open the door for the season opener for the Utah Weekend Car Meet. So if you're in Utah, I will put the link to the Utah Weekend Car Meet down below. So go check that out. And we will see you guys next time.